Welcome back to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting and challenging rational equation. Equation is 1 over x plus 2 times x plus 4 equal to square root 5x square plus 30x plus 46. We have to find out real solutions. So let's get started by writing domain. I will write two points. Radicand should be positive. This is point number 1. And because of right hand side we are having a square root, this should be positive. This is point number 2. For LHS to be positive, this product should be positive. x plus 2 times x plus 4, this product should be always positive. Okay, so I will draw one number line. I will put here minus 2. Then I need to write here minus 4. This is our somewhere 0. So I will write x plus 2. Let me write here x plus 4. Now let us put the sign convention. x greater than minus 2, then x plus 2 will be positive. But before that it would be negative. x plus 4, once x is greater than minus 4, x plus 4 will be positive. Before that it would be negative. So now check where this product is coming out positive. So this is positive. Here it is negative. Positive. So conclusion is once x is greater than minus 2, so product is positive and when x is less than minus 4, product is positive. So in between minus 4 and minus 2, we cannot expect our solution. So let me write here overall condition x should be greater than minus 2 or x should be less than minus 4. So our solution should not lie in between minus 2 and minus 4. Now come to RHS. I will consider the radicand should be positive. So for that purpose, I will check only discriminant. First it should be real. Then we will find out the condition. It should be positive. So let me check our discriminant. Delta B square minus 4 AC. So it, this value is 30 square minus 4 times 5 times c is 46. 30 square is 900 minus 20 times 46, 920. So this value is coming out minus 20 because of discriminant is negative. Complex solution will generate. So no need to check. So only condition that is x should be greater than minus 2 and x should be less than minus 4. In between solution is not accepted between minus 4 and minus 2. Let us consider our equation. Let us find out how to solve. So I will write our LHS as multiply it x square plus the product of these two 4x plus 2x 6x plus 8. Right hand side I will write in this manner 5x square plus 30x plus 40 plus 6. I split 46 in 40 and 6 like this. Now from first three terms, left hand side I will keep as it is x square plus 6x plus 8. Now RHS I will write 5 common. x square plus 6x plus 8. Bracket is closed then I will write plus 6. Now let us consider substitution which is obvious also. So let us consider x square plus 6x plus 8 equal to suppose t. So left hand side I will be having 1 over t. Right hand side would be square root of 5t plus 6. Cross multiply. So I will be writing t square root 5t plus 6 equal to 1. Because I have taken now I am going to consider the squaring. So extraneous solution will add. Let us consider squaring to remove this square root. t square times 5t plus 6 equal to 1. Take all the term to one side. I will be writing 5t cube plus 6t square 
minus 1 equal to 0. So this is one cubic equation. I will use factorization method. So let us consider factorization. Let me write this equation once again. 5t cube plus 6t square minus 1 equal to 0. I will split 60 square as 5t square, you can use SDM also, plus t square. And then I will write minus 1 equal to 0. Let us consider 5t square common. So in bracket it will be t plus 1. And last two term I will apply difference of 2 squares. So I can write t minus 1 times t plus 1 equal to 0. Let's take t plus 1 completely common. So I will be having one quadratic equation 5t square plus t minus 1 equal to 0. Now you can see one solution is clear. It is t is equal to minus 1 from this bracket. From second quadratic equation, let us find out the t value first. Minus b putting this quadratic equal to 0. Minus b, so minus 1, plus minus under the root b square, so 1 square is 1, minus 4ac, so plus 20, divided by 2a. So I can write here, minus 1 plus minus square root 21 over 2. Now if you will check the value of square root 21, then it is approximately 4.58. So I will write plus minus 4.58 divided by 2. So I will write here the t value minus 1 plus 4.58. So it would be minus 3.58 over 2. So denominator will be 2 times 5 it is. So it is denominator is 10. So let me write here. I will write 3.58 over 10. And second value I will write minus 5.58 over 10. So I can write 0 0.358. And second value I will write minus 0 0.558. Two values. Now from first t value let us put the value of t. See this value. And see two values are here. Let us put the value of t, our substitution, t was, t was our substitution x square plus 6x plus 8. Let's put the value. I will write x square plus 6x plus 8 equal to minus 1. This is for t equal to minus 1. So x square plus 6x plus 9 equal to 0 and this is one perfect square x plus 3 whole square it is equal to 0. So from here I will conclude x should be minus 3 and minus 3. Minus 3 with multiplicity 2. One important point our domain was x should be greater than minus 2 and x should be less than minus 4. So it is lying in between minus 2 and minus 4. So this solution we will reject. Rejected as per domain. So this solution we won't accept. Now let us consider t is equal to two values we calculated minus 0.558 and t is equal to 0.358. Now I will put the value of t x square plus 6x plus 8 for both the quadratic equation x square plus 6x plus 8 equal to 0 0.558 and here also let me solve here itself x square plus 6x plus 8 equal to 0 0.358 now i will take all the term to one side x square plus 6x 8 minus 0 0.558 it was negative sign so i have to add 8 plus 0 0.558 once you will take two lhs so it will become 8 
0.558 equal to 0. Similarly, right hand side x square plus 6x, 8 minus 0 0.358, it will be 7.642 equal to 0. Now, two quadratic equations, I have to use quadratic formula to find out result solutions. So, let me write here x is equal to minus b. So, minus 6 plus minus under the root b square 36 minus 4 times 8.558. So, this value is 34.232 divided by 2. So, if you will find out this value, so I am writing directly, it is coming out minus 2.33 and minus 3.16 if you will check both the results both the values both solutions are rejected as both solutions are lying in between minus 4 and minus 2 so not accepted this domain was not accepted not accepted so we will reject both the solutions as it is lying in between minus 4 and minus 2 now the only chances of getting solution that is this quadratic equation. Let us find out this solution here. Let me write separately x square plus 6x plus 7.642 equal to 0. Let us apply quadratic formula x is equal to minus b. So I will write x is equal to minus 6 plus minus under the root b square so 36 minus 7.642 times 4 so 30.568 divided by 2a so 2 then i will write minus 6 plus minus under the root 36 minus 30 so i will write 5 point it would be 5.432 divided by 2 minus 6 plus minus what will be the root of this number 2.33 it is approximate value all values are approximate value divided by 2 so i will write the exact value minus 1.84 by taking plus sign and with minus sign it is minus 4.16 and both solutions are accepted this time as it is not lying in between minus 2 and minus 4. So both solutions are accepted solutions. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.